high comments. We can't wait to see y'all back on campus July the 6th. In order for um, phase one to, to happen and be successful, uh, there are several guidelines that have been put in place that we have to follow. One, participants cannot arrive more than 15 minutes prior to their practice, practice session. Uh, two, all participants must exit immediately after their workout session has concluded. There can be no conjugation of uh, friends, so once you uh, get done practicing, uh, you must leave the campus immediately. Next, all participants, coaches, players are going to be screened upon their arrival on campus. This screening, screening will uh, consist of taking your temperature and asking all coaches and players um, a, a series of uh, questions about your symptoms. Uh, a record will be kept on file. Uh, next, all spectators, um, we're asking y'all to not come on campus during this time period. If you are on campus, we ask that uh, you remain in your car during this time period. Thank you and go Comets. Wake up, it's time to go to workouts. Good morning. Good morning. How are we feeling today? Good. All right, I'm going to take your temperature, okay? Okay. All right. Uh, I'm going to ask you a few questions. Had any cough, shortness of breath? No, ma'am. Uh, any sore throat? No. Uh, loss of taste or smell? No, ma'am. Diarrhea or vomiting? No. Been around anybody that's been tested positive for COVID in no, the last two weeks? All right, you're good to go. Thank you. Good morning. Hey, good morning. How are we doing today? Just fine. All right, if you'll remove your cap for me, I'm going to take your temperature. Oh man, have you been feeling all right lately? Uh, not not the best. Okay, well you got a temperature of 101. Uh, is mom still here? Yes, yeah, she is. All right, I'm gonna give her this paper. You're gonna have to go to the doctor and have a test and then be cleared to come back to practice, all right? Okay. All right, go get mom for me, please. All right, thank you. Thank you. Hey guys, we can't wait to see you back on campus and, and ready to work out. Uh, there are a few things though that we need to make sure that you're aware of so that we can make the return to play phase one successful. Um, no matter how crazy you might think these rules are, this is going to be what it takes to get you back on the field in August. So number one, we will practice social distancing at all times. We must stay six feet apart uh, at stations, standing in line, during conditioning, um, and chalk talk sessions. There will be absolutely no touching allowed, no hugs, no high fives, absolutely no physical contact. All equipment and facilities will be sanitized after every use. Please do not touch equipment until you are instructed to do so. No indoor facilities, locker rooms, restrooms, water fountains or water coolers will be available. We are very excited that we're getting the chance for athletics to start back up. Some very important things to remember. One, bring your own water jug. Two, you absolutely cannot share water. Three, water fountains or coolers will not be available for use. And number four, if you do not bring your own water jug, you will not be allowed to participate. Thank you. Okay guys, remember social distancing, keep your six feet apart while you're sprinting. On your mark, go! Hi guys, we're all working very hard for you to get back on campus and working out to prepare for the upcoming fall season. But we need your help. You are the key to ensuring that come August, the Comet teams will have a chance at competing. You can give yourself and your teammates the best chance by following the following rules. 
One, if you have symptoms, just stay at home. Two, wash your hands thoroughly and frequently. Three, wear a face mask whenever possible in public. And four, practice social distancing, six feet apart always.